Sometimes cooking up a special food dish mm -hmm. can help you win people over. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. No? Food is universal. Like when Brooke gave her son's t-ball coach a plate of her famous chocolate cookies laced with Viagra. Oh, no. Whoa. Got into his good graces <laughs> real quick. Uh, Just looking for some grand slams, Jeff. Mm -hmm. oh. But, oh. On the field. <laughs> Sure. <laughs> on the field. But blue sprinkles. One yeah. of our listeners says when he started dating a new woman, he attempted to win her children over by preparing them a special kid's breakfast. Aww. Aww. And That's cute. Even well, though it was a success, he swore nobody could learn the truth behind the secret recipe that oh, he no. used, oh. or they would never forgive him for it. Oh, You're going to no. understand why in your brand oh, new oh, mass oh, speaker oh. coming up at 710. You don't know me. Session I can't take back. I am the masked speaker. Texas 78592 says, My family thinks my therapy sessions are two hours long, mm -hmm. but it's actually only one. Oh, the yeah. other hour is me going out to the woods and playing with fire. Oh! oh. Okay. <laughs> Before or after you talk to the therapist? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> the therapist. <laughs> Do we hang on to this text and pass it to the authorities? Uh, can we get him a more safe hobby? Yeah. yeah you know, like you're gonna start a wildfire, buddy. Get out of or there. Or a better therapist. Like, yeah, <laughs> that's what you need. Uh, well, I just deleted that text. Oh. No, the whole yeah. point is we're supposed to make this a safe space, uh, unlike the forest where that guy yeah. plays. Okay, so no evidence. We have another dude on the phone who's ready to enter our safe space. He's okay. chosen to go by. <laughs> Derek, don't read into that. You always sound so uh, Sorry. Weird. I can't help it. I, know, I mean, it's you. if people could see your face, too, it doesn't help the situation. I know, it's a very sexy face. Okay. Derek, welcome to the show. Hey, how's it going? This is the only excitement Jeff gets all week. Yeah. So this better be good, Derek. Yeah. I am ready. The yeah. voice changer you is on. Are. Derek, you're the mass speaker now. Whenever you're ready, let's hear your confession. All right. So this was years ago when I first started dating my wife. Oh, okay. okay. Does she know this story or does she not? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh okay. Oh, that makes better. me so much more interested. <laughs> yeah. We know something she doesn't. Tell Ooh. us about your wife early on in the relationship. Okay, so she had two kids already. Okay. okay. She was, like really, really buttoned up and extremely like professional woman, like very intimidating girl. And uh, Yeah, she's a mother. Okay. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, we throw up hands. Yeah, we're throwing like hand signs abuses. with mother. <laughs> mother. Okay. Mom again. Dude, we know how to do it. All right. That can be intimidating <laughs> to enter into a relationship with like a fully established mom. Yeah. And kind of plugging myself into this family unit, I wanted to show her I was the right guy. Yeah. Okay. So part of that is taking care of the kiddos. Mm -hmm. So I had spent the night there one night and I wanted to do something really nice. So I woke up like an hour and a half before she gets up to make them breakfast before school. Wow. Oh, wow. That's so cute. Wow. What a special treat. What'd yeah. you make? Yeah, I found pancake mix. Oh. I made a batch. Like, I made them, like, a nice tall stack. I even cut them into, like, little Mickey Mouse heads. Oh, wow. Oh. Please tell me you cleaned the kitchen up afterwards to actually make it um, <laughs> a special yeah. thing for her as well. Neutral. Yeah, yeah. I didn't leave her with a mess. But okay. Oh, okay. Anyway, they came, they saw their plates. They were so happy. I was looking at these pancakes. I'm wanting some for myself. So I go back in the kitchen to make daddy a nice little stack. <laughs> Did you call yourself daddy there? <laughs> hey, some of us call ourselves different names. Sure. Papa Bear, daddy. Let's say not in front of the children. Okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so, oh, that's true. Like daddy's going to, that's Time a good to point, make bro. your pancakes now. <laughs> so listen, as I'm mixing, I'm like, huh, there's something weird kind of clumpy, lumpy in the pancake mix. And I look closely, I start stirring through them, and I, I take a fork. They were maggots. No. Oh, Yay! God. Maggots. Hang up the phone. I don't want to hear anything else. Oh. Oh. And you've already served it up to the kids? So, yeah, I'm panicking. <laughs> oh, my God. You think they think it's cool? Like, there's a bug in my pancake. <laughs> well, the bug's dead by then, so yeah. it's not like it's moving. Oh. These are now Halloween pancakes. Like the suckers with the dead yeah. bug in the middle. Yeah, yeah. those were so Why cool. are these pancakes crunchy? <laughs> Dude, what do you do? Oh. So I go in the dining room where they're sitting, and they're almost done. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh. Did you notice? Dude, whatever you do, please tell me that your girlfriend then, now wife, didn't come down and ask for her serving. Oh, gosh. No, no, no. But you know what was funny? 
the kids would not shut up about how good the pancakes were. Oh. Well, they're slathered in yeah. syrup and butter. You probably can't taste it. Well, I, no, I, I think they could taste it because they they were asking me, hey, did you do something different? Mom oh. must doesn't make it like this. <laughs> there was like an aftertaste. Do you know what they thought I put in there? What? what? They are like, did you put almonds in or something? Oh, oh got a crunch to it. <laughs> <laughs> Almond pancakes. Ugh. How old are the kids now? Do they know? Uh, let's see. They were seven and five, so I guess they're 12 and 10 now. And no, no, no. Oh. Still no. Oh, my <laughs> God. Dude, when are you going to tell them? Is it going to be like at the wedding speeches? Or are you going to do it? Or is you this know? it? Just send this to them. Because yeah. you baked the cake, and there's maggots in the cake hey. now, too. <laughs> Full circle. Oh, man. Yeah, I, I would never tell that oh secret. Oh, my God. Have they been asking for your special pancakes ever since? <laughs> the first time I made pancakes after that time, they asked for almonds in it again. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> so I put almonds in it, and they're like, it doesn't taste like that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the magic touch. Oh, the maggot touch. Oh, there it gross. is. <laughs> oh, God. Like, you know what? For the first time ever, I'm not hungry in the morning. Yeah. I'm, I'm Usually when we get a food confession, yeah, we're I'm all, gonna... like, dying to order something. Yeah. <laughs> not today. I skip breakfast this morning. <laughs> wow. Well, Derek, thanks for the call. We appreciate it. I'm never going to look at pancake mix the same ever after oh. this. <laughs> we are getting more text confessions into 78592 about wives and marriages. This one says, my lovely wife is incapable of losing at Monopoly. She's oh. really, really good. She cannot lose. On family Christmases, she doesn't even realize the rest of the family tries to gang up on her, and she still smashes us every Whoa. time. Oh, my God. Dude, that's crazy. What's the strap there? I don't know, but she should be in real estate. Like, do you buy everything or do you put everything up for auction right when you <laughs> land on it? But keep your text coming in 78592. If you have a confession you've been holding on to, we can hide your identity, mask your voice, and make yeah. you our next mass speaker. Your phone tap's coming up right after this.